see you. Okay, go ahead, Mohad. Hello? Yes, Mohad, you are a Muslim? Yes, alhamdulillah. How old, how old are you? Fifteen. Is your dad there? No. What? Oh, I want to ask you some questions. You are so young to talk to you. If you, you know, you are too young. Yes, let me let me just ask you some questions. All right. Okay, ask me a question. All right. So you believe Islam is from Satan? No, I believe Islam is Satan. All right. Can me too. All right. Open up uh, Matthew chapter twelve, verse twenty-six. Tell oh, me okay. what it says. You tell me what it says. It says if Satan casts uh -huh. out Satan, uh -huh. his kingdom will be divided, uh, and his kingdom will fall. Okay. This Islam is, story, Islam, is of this story. Islam is divided, oh? and the kingdom of Satan is uh, is doomed. Your prophet himself he said that the the faith of Islam will die, and right away after he died he said that. Don't you know that? No, oh, but let's all right. Show me. Okay, here we go. You, okay, if you if you click at my page in YouTube, you will see in the top of my page, Sahih Muslim, your prophet he said that Islam will go back like a serpent, going back to its hole, which is in Mecca. So Islam will shrink, faith will die, and even the Muslim will be misleaded by the Quran. As an example, not limited. Here, here we go. This is. This is hadith from your prophet from at Tirmidhi. Yes, it's, uh, which it's, one? Uh, hadith uh, in page number seven one eight in the book of at Tirmidhi. Here in front of you, I, I'm showing you in the screen. I can I can give you the link. You can use Google Translation. If you want to invite your dad to join you, that will be better, so he can help you. Whoever died, well, he had a man to fast. That's not the same uh, hadith. Which hadith are no, you seeing right now? The same had hadith here says that the, the Muslim will be misled by the book of Allah. It says here that Gabriel... Yes, but can, which hadith? Can I get the specific hadith? Uh, in this page, it doesn't say the number, but uh, it's uh, in the term of the uh, page number 718. I just give you the link. Open the link. All right. So Jibril, at uh, Jibril, he came to me, and he said he was so sad. Muhammad, he came so sad. Omar Khattab, he said, and uh, he was very sad. So I said, "What's up with you, Prophet? Why you are sad?" He said, "Gabriel, he came to me, and he said, your people will be misled after you, which means after your death." I said to Jibril. How they will be misled by from guidance or from belief? He said both. He said how they will how this will happen, and I leave the book with Allah of Allah with them. He said by the book of Allah they will be misled. So what the Bible says is clear: the kingdom of Satan is very much divided. Muslim are divided. Muslims they killed the grandsons of Muhammad right away after he died. Right away, all the caliphate were died and killed by Muslims. So what do you talk? What are you talking about? All you Muslims are doomed from the beginning of Islam. Even your prophet was accused by Muslims that he stole an underwear. Correct? What? He stole an underwear? Yeah, but a nice one. Isn't it, isn't it the Quran says that the Muslim, the companion, they said that the prophet is the one who took the underwear of the Jew? And then Allah, well, He says, said, and then Allah, He says. Oh, by the way, I got uh, I got an explanation from Abu Dawood. I opened up his book. What he said: This is like Islam. Islam is gonna shrink. Uh -huh. Islam is gonna fall, and then it's gonna come back. Well, and this but, is in the but you, Quran. But, it's but you remember? But you remember? Hold on, no, it's going to come back when? When? Uh, at the day of judgment. When the day of when judgment, Isaac, okay, hold on. Will come the day back. of judgment is over. I mean, what what, what come? <laughs> if if the Islam is going is gone, and then in the day of judgment it's too late. People are dead. That's it. No, but, again, again, what I meant, what I meant, is that Isa alayhi salam is gonna come and uh -huh. fight the jail. Okay. And then me, Islam will rise back again. Okay, let me ask you. Why Isa yes. is the one who will fight the jail at Muhammad? 
Because he's a prophet. Every prophet has a uh, power. Every prophet has a prophecy. What, what is the power of your prophet? Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam. He was a noble prophet. He, he how he is he a noble had, he had, how he is a noble prophet, and his followers are you know accusing him of stealing in the world. Read the Quran, chapter three, verse one sixty one. The noble prophet accused by you, the noble you, companions. Huh? Right, Christian prince. If we're gonna compare compare all the prophets, which uh, and we're gonna say Muhammad's one of those prophets. Which prophet will had a difficult life? Difficult life since the birth. Yes, yeah, since the birth. Well, Muhammad, he you know he have a difficult life. I agree. Uh, as an example, uh, according to Muhammad, he uh, uh, he was suffering from epilepsy. Oh, but his parents died to at his birth. But, uh, his but, parents died as his uh, first, birth. His first, own family abolished him. His okay, own family okay. abolished him. Okay. To... Why they abolish him? Is that because he's a good boy or because he was a bad person? Well, it was it was mostly because. Uh, no, I heard that yeah, he was. A, no, I no heard that he. I heard that because he was a bad person. And he was behaving, misbehaving with the girls of the family, so they get rid of him and they send him far away. No, this is false. Uh, the reason this is false. why Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam okay. was abolished As because of Muhammad, his, listen, listen. his spirit teaching. Muhammad abolished what? What? I didn't say that. Said, I said his family abolished Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam because of his weird teachings. As we know, Arabia at that time was a, was a horrific uh, time. The people killed their daughters. The people uh, worship, uh, worship literally. They were my, literally my friend, pagans. My friend, my friend, all those yes, stories, yes. all those stories you are saying to me, it's absolutely false. Where in the Quran it says that the the Arab they killed their daughters? You want me to show proof? Yeah. You didn't know that. You didn't know Arabs killed. No. I'll show you. Because if the Arab killed their daughters, then how the Arab have daughters and kids? <laughs> yes, that was that was uh, that was the dumb logic of no. uh, the Arabs. No, you are just an ignorant like the rest of, of of the Muslims. The Quran does not say that the Arab killed their daughters. It says when the soul will be asked for which reason it was killed, the soul, not the infant. Nowhere it says infant. So the Muslims all right, when they me, hold on. So when the Muslim they say such a statement, it's a fabrication. When the soul will be asked, not the girl. <laughs> Can you show me the word girl in the verse? You Muslims, yes, you'll, you what they give me? Give you what? You want me to give you the time? Wait. This is the verse in the front of your eyes. Chapter 81, verse number 8. This is not about a female infant. You Muslim lie when you translate. And I challenge any Muslim to show me the word female. If you show me the word female, I will shave my 20 meter beard. You will? I will. I will make... Oh, I will make one of right, my cousins. Quran, Quran chapter 8, Quran chapter uh, 81, uh -huh. verse 8 to 9. Open it doesn't say anything about infant. You Muslims are a bunch of liars. It's what? yeah. This is speaking about the soul, the soul, the soul, the soul, the soul, the soul. Here we go. When the soul shall be joined with their body, the soul, the soul will be Where asked. Stands it? What are you reading? The verse before it, verse number seven. You Muslim, you lie in the translation. There's no female. There's no infant. All those words are I... not exist. Ayah 8. Huh? Read Ayah 8. Yeah, where is the Read word? Ayah okay, show me where is the word infant. Show me the word female and infant. I want to see it. You want in the Arab version, am I right? Arab version? What Arab version? Show me where it says female. The Arab, uh, the Arab uh, translation. Yes, yes, I'll show you. Oh, me, show me, show uh, me. Uh -huh. seconds. <laughs> I have to go easy with him. He's just a kid. <laughs> Wait, will you shave off your beard? I already shaved it. I lost with you, that's it. <laughs> you Muslims are a bunch of potatoes. You lie to yourself, you add things. You see, they say that the Quran is not corrupt. Look at this corruption. All those things you see here in the translation is not exist. Where is the word female? Where is the word infant? Where it says that? 
Can you show me the word female and the word infant? Just give me tw uh, two seconds. Okay, two, uh, I'll give you two days. Why you don't call your dad? What? Why you don't call your dad to join you? Why should I? Because your dad, his dad. I don't, go easy. You don't You don't respect your dad? No, I want to go easy on you. Oh, okay. Thank you. We could tell your mom to make you a sandwich if you need more time. What happened? Show me the word, the word oh, female. Uh, what is the word female in the verse? Yes, let me read it in Arabic. I'm not, uh, I'll just, uh, I'm still learning Arabic. Give oh, me you that. are still learning Arabic. Uh, uh, take it easy on me. Okay. What happened? You are taking advantage of me, what? right? Because I don't know Arabic, and you are very good in Arabic, and that's why you are coming here to show your muscles, and I will look like a fool in yes. front of everybody. Thank you very much. Shame on you. Is that what you do for people no who they are younger than you? Don't you know that I'm 14 years what? old? Is that because I'm younger than you take advantage of me? This is what the Muslim yes. they will say now. The Muslim they will say, Christian Prince is debating a kid. Well, all of you are kids. Uh, by the way, Aisha, she was six years old. She was a mother of the believers at the age of six. Based in this, you are a grandfather of Aisha. You are 15. You are very old. So did you find the word girl and infant or it's a fabrication? Where is the word girl and where is the word infant? What does it say in Arabic? What is it? Can you read it out? I don't, I don't what know Arabic. You tell me. I want to find the word girl. Call, your, call your dad. Call Arabic. your dad. No, call your dad. Call your dad. What? Tell what? Him, get, no, no. Read it in Arabic. Listen, listen. Your please. dad in the kitchen doing dishes to his mom as all Muslim they do. Ask him to come for five minutes and let him read it for you and tell me where is the word infant and girl. I want to see them. Tell your mom to give him a break. I mean, the poor guy. He did the laundry, he did everything on Sunday. So let what him What are come. you talking about? Your dad, where is your dad? You cannot read it, then your dad can read it. Okay, bring your mom. Give me five seconds. Good. Again, five okay. seconds? Yes. Oh. So your dad is doing dishes right now. I, I agree. I like that. All right, so uh, Christian Prince, uh -huh. I, I I can't read Arabic very good. I can't prove it to you that oh, in okay, Arabic okay, it's awesome. Okay, bring, I can okay, but, you, but, 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 but bring me your dad, but. Take your butt out of here. What a bunch of potatoes. You see how they lie? All those words are not exist in the Quran. This verse is about the soul. A person who was killed, his soul will be questioned. For what reason you being killed, murdered, why? No word about female, no word about infant, have nothing to do with this garbage. Every single Muslim is, is, a, is an idiot until he proved the opposite. They don't even use their brain. It says in the front of you, when the souls will be joined, the souls, the souls, and this soul will be asked, what is the word female? The body of the person is al mawuda the body. Jutha. 